Okay, what's good y'all? It's your boy Haiga and today I'm gonna do a quick little simple video on how you can beat the Bundozer. We've failed multiple times, but we pretty much know his cheats now. And just in case it's your first time going through, you don't really understand what's going on. You got one shotted just like we did. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and oh no, hopefully explain what's going on, right? So we're here to save Hans. You have to do the battle in the beginning. I do want to uh, note this isn't test realm. If you're watching this when this is out in live realm, things may be different. As of right now in test realm, if you flee the battle or if you're defeated, you have to restart the dungeon. So you have to do the first mob battle again as well. But um, there's a few things to note about this boss. Uh, number one, if you join late, you die pretty much. You get one shot. He does a lot of damage, a lot of damage. Also on round one, he does a very, very powerful hit. Uh, what I think I'm gonna test right now is see if we shield see if that um, Hinders any of the damage, but I think regardless of that um, we should be okay. Another thing to note is that he's a sun boss Similar to King Detritus. So typically you would think ice storm boost on him, but it says that ice resists So I don't know. It's it's kind of weird right now. Uh, the main Idea is just to faint you can blade if it's protected. He only takes one blade at a time so if you use elemental blade, I believe it takes the fire one. So I was still able to use elemental blade. And if you don't hit him within, I believe, three rounds, three or four rounds, he nukes you. And it hurts a lot. Um, how to prevent that is by hitting him. So we're going to test wand hits here as well. But mainly the goal is just to trap, faint as many times as we can and hopefully take care of him and kill him um if i were you i would pack a shield to see right. if that helps with the first hit that he does so but otherwise this should be okay well i'm curious though is what if you hit him first round and it stops him from doing the low cheat we can see we i mean i don't have many cards in so i will pull one two three four five six seven eight yeah i'll pull a wand hit so we can test it Let's see. All right. And let's keep in mind, I'm raw, I'm pulling up with 88 resist, and he was still just absolutely nuking us. So, um, let's go ahead. I got my potent faints. I'm going to go ahead and wand attack him, see if that prevents him from doing that nuke thing in the beginning. Okay. Because both times that me and Alex have done this, after round one ends, he just erases like half of your health. It's kind of ridiculous. No, this is not the last boss. This is just the first boss that's like somewhat difficult. Like, this man's cheats hurt, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, so he yeah. doesn't. Okay. Okay. So if you okay. if someone hits him round one, he doesn't nuke you guys. So it is okay. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, now here's and the thing. Freedom, and then you have freedom for like three rounds. Yeah. So now we just need to hit before he does it again. And... He doesn't warn you when he does it the first time, but before he does it a second time, they give you a, a cheat warning. It'll say that he's gurgling or something like that. So that's when you know he's about to do it. Will damage overtime work? You don't want to use a damage overtime because I have to faint him, right? So I want to hit him and then faint, 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 and then we can just kill him. That's, that's the goal here. So I already put a regular pot in and a boot pot in. So we should be okay. So Belloc, but rank 19. Kind of. Belloc, you have to hit him every round. This guy, every time you hit him, it just kind of resets his cooldown to like every three rounds. Um, it is good. So yeah, he's going to hit after this round. So it, we got to hit right now. Nice, perfect. Yeah, I'm so gonna faint. This boss is basically like on par with Shane Von Shane. Yeah. Similar to Shane. 
but hits way harder. <laughs> way harder. Oh, yeah. Extremely hard. Like, this guy's... Me is, if they're already starting to deal damage like this now, imagine how it's going to be later. Yeah, it's, it's kind of nuts how much damage he was doing. So he does boost fire. That's so weird. Oh, yeah, you're a goner. Do we kill the minion? I don't know if we kill the minion, though. Because you had no blades. Yeah, see? That's all, uh, barrage. Yeah, that crit block, uh, crit block, crit block system is going ham. Well, I don't have any more. <laughs> I don't have any more feints. It's all right. I could wand attack, though, and you know I'm a crit. Even in my jade gear. Hey, free 150 damage. It's just weird how you're critting everything. Because, like, I feel like this whole crit thing is just another damage enhancement. Yeah, it's kind of weird. It's kind of weird. Don't know entirely like, how it I, works yet. Because the way I see it is... They should have made it two uh, separate stats. Like crit resist and crit block. Crit yeah, yeah. damage. Like, the higher your rating, I guess what they're trying to do is the higher your rating it pertains to your like crit damage versus the block yeah 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 go for it I thought you were gonna Shatterhorn could've I mean on the bright side out of this battle we were able to see that new life spell oh yeah Nice. Easy money. And didn't I get nuked. Funny. Oh, I got Amber. I got a 140 <gasps> a theme. I should think so after I got that sad, silly display. You got a spell Mm-hmm. Shatterhorn spell -ament. Ooh. So they are school lock. Okay, I, I didn't chase. <laughs> I have been swallowed. I, I have also got a lot of works wonton, which is an arena snack. Company, all because of your mission. Interesting. Huh? What? Sorry, my head. It is all swimmy and muddled and tangy. I need a minute. Hans, wait. Right, row. Well, that's it for I forgot his name. The bun, bun dude, the bunny bun. Hopefully it helped, but yeah, see you guys later. Enjoy test.